Welcome water sign. This is the last week of the month of June. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Water signs. What is happening? Okay. So water sign this week is going to be a good money. Yes, it could be the end of the month that you're receiving your salary. So that could be one of the reason, but I see work is going to be good for you guys. All right. So like, what is the message that is you're coming in this week with harmony and you're leaving the week emerging. This is a wonderful, wonderful um, situation because what is happening and what is transpiring is that the situation in uh, this month has been um, a whole lot for you, um, Pisces. And um, I'm sorry, you water sign people. And I want to say, um, you know, water sign people, Pisces, Cancer and Scorpion, um, it has been ups and down, ups and down, ups and down. And everyone is having this, but you guys are feeling it like the most. Okay. And, um, harmony, um, coming in this week, harmony, cause this could be payday, um, for some of you. And I see money is coming in and I see some money is coming in, but you have an enemy. So you are happy that you received some money, some financial help, because here you can see the center is you men um and it is you men um you wither and these are people who their wives have died um uh, and they're still dealing with a, a whole lot of sadness but i see you have an enemy at the same time so um it could be a situation where you businessmen um your wife has died and i see that at the moment, you be careful and watch over your business and your money, okay? I see you're having some hope, but I see you have loyal people that is going to be helping you out, and this is good. So as we look at this, is that um, money is here, money is going to be coming in, and that's why there is so much harmony. But some of you, be aware and on top of the game that you have a male enemy, so, ladies and gentlemen, whether um, woman or man, I've, if you're a woman, you have a male enemy. So, you got to be aware. This is someone on the work floor. So, be aware of this because there is a male enemy. This person is on the work floor. So, you got to be on top of your game and know exactly what is transpiring. Um, some of you, um, this person could have owed you a lot of money. And I see that this person is definitely... Um, you could have all this business partner, especially um, men who have investors. I see that this investor is becoming a real pain in you know what. Okay, so got to be aware of this because you men who had borrowed some money or um, borrow from someone, an investor, you got to be on top of your game because this person is really a pain in the butt and they're going to be um, becoming your enemy. So you know, they gladly lend you this money, but you have no idea how much you have to pay on this money um, in the future. OK, so you got to be aware and on top of your game because this person um, gladly lend you the money. But you're just going to be getting deeper and deeper um, indebted to this um, business partner. So be aware of that, because um, what we see is, here is transparent and it's happening is that uh, Whoever this business partner is and whatever is transpiring, this person is keeping you in debt by them. Okay, so you got to be on top of your game. I see um, you men, um, especially businessmen or uh, men um, at work, you have some sadness about some money. Why? What is this reason and what is the sadness about the money? There is some um, distressful situation that is going on. And you are saddened. So it, it it's coming up as men and women where some of you could have thought that you were going to get a raise or some money is going to be coming in. But I see um, it's affecting mostly the men and younger women. Um, so men six years and older or 50 years and older, younger women, um, 18 to 45. I see this is affecting you guys, that there is some issue with some money and you have an enemy that is someone that has worked against you. So be aware of this because it's affecting um, men 50 years and older and you have whatever the issue is and the situation is. 
I see you have an enemy, but you're not aware of this enemy. Whoever this enemy is, you're not aware of this person. And I see um, some people are going to be staying faithful to some of you. So some money um, is going to be coming in, but whoever is uh, um, giving you this money is your biggest enemy. So this is going to be happening to some of you businessmen and some of you entrepreneurs. Um, whoever this investor is, this investor is not supposed to be trusted. Okay. So whoever is going to be asking for a loan in this week, whether a personal loan or, um, an investor for some financial help, this person is not supposed to be trusted. And this person is happy that you did it because they're going to be holding you at ransom in the end. I see that you're going to be finding out that people, um, are you know loyal to you and i see especially you ladies you're going to be finding out that a girlfriend or a friend or um some business partner is very loyal to you this could be um someone you have met on at work and i see you're going through some sadness but this person is really being loyal to you and sort of helping you out because you are you ladies are going through some sadness at this moment. But I see this is a younger person that is being loyal to you. No matter what is transpiring, this person is being very loyal to you. So this could be a younger person on the work floor. And they are showing you their loyal, loyalty. And this is going to be good. So what I'm seeing here is that... Um, you older men, 50 years and older, you're, you have some um, worries whether or not you are going to be surviving after the death of your wife because some of you have paid out and, you know, you're worried about your job at the same time. But there is so much sadness and grief that you're go you're having to deal with at work. So the sadness and grief that you're going through and this displacement of the of money and that sort of a thing. I see you're really going through the sadness and grief, but you're going to be okay. Um, I see that people at work, especially at work, is going to be loyal to you. I see some of you are going to be asking for a loan and it's going to be a yes because I see that um, you have been loyal to a company and the company is going to be in turn be loyal to you. So this is um, really, really positive what is transpiring. So as we look at um, the first half of the week for some of you, it has to do with some money is coming in, but some of you are receiving some money from a loan shark, okay? And, I, and, and I'm telling you this, this is a loan shark because this man is coming for you in the future. Um, this is an infix. There's some of you are going to be borrowing money from a loan shark. I see you're happy that you get the money, but this person is a loan shark, Okay. This person is a loan shark. This person is a mafia. This person is very, very deceptive. Um, this is a deceptive business person. So I'm warning you because, yeah, you're happy to have this money, but it's going to be paid back at a higher cost than you will ever imagine. So be aware of that because that is exactly what is going to be transpiring. So, you know, happiness that this money is coming in, but this is like, this loan shark is going to be taken from you and at the end of the day, you're going to be having some problems with this loan shark. So I am warning you, you need the money, but there are other ways of getting money. This man is a loan shark and a very deceptive person. This person is one of your biggest enemy. Um, a loan shark is nobody's friends and nobody business partner because this person is only out of for money, 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 more money. This is not a person that you should be really taking this money from, even though you need it. Then we have the energy here of you ladies are saddened by a situation with your boss and you realize that your boss was your biggest enemy. Um, you ladies are really as, as if um, you were open for a promotion or a salary increase and you went to your boss it's not going to happen this person is very deceptive um your boss is actually um 
you know, I he runs a department and he runs a company, but this man is really crude and creed. If I were you, I would go look for something else or keep an eye out for something else. And I see a, a loyal girlfriend is going to be helping you to find something else. And trust me, at the end of the week, you're going to be merging from um, this situation because you're going to be coming out of this uh, um, you know, you ladies have been working so hard and you had thought and expected that, um, you know, you would, your career would have been higher than this. And you have been going and working for this person for a very long time. And this person and these people are, you know, managers only think about themselves. You are a cause. Okay. And if you do your work, okay, it is good. But you ladies are realizing Jesus I am giving so much and I'm getting absolutely nothing back. And you ladies are like, gee, um, you know, isn't it better that I find something else? I've been going at this. Um, I haven't had a salary um, increase for so long. And, uh, you know, it is, it is something that you begin to think for yourself and begin to realize that um, this situation, this, um, this job, this business or it's more of a job because you're working for someone that this person is just extorting you basically because you have been giving them so much and you have been um one of this person who will stay and overtime not even your overtime is being paid out so it is as if you realize that because of the uh, the the COVID time that your boss is um taking um you know is using it to um like extort you um because no overpay has been paid out and that sort of a thing and they expect you to be there and uh, do more and you're like yeah um but i'm not being paid i'm not being paid for my overtime i need to also be with my kids and that sort of a thing and you're going to be seeing the unfairness uh, um with your boss and i see um someone who um realize what is going on it's going to be saying hey um hey i know someone else in a company i'm going to see if they have an opening they pay much better and i see that this person could be um you know um they realize that you know this man has not been um very fair Who, whoever your boss is hasn't been very fair to the whole thing because you have are there the beginning of the morning and in the evening and and has been given so much towards this company and this corporation and you're not getting back uh, your full choices and i see some of you got a review a performance review and i you know it was they weren't honest and i see that you're going to be um realizing hey um i i shift the energy my my energy is shift and i'm really seeing the the deceptiveness and dishonesty and some of you are going to be realizing in a performance review that um your performance is good but they don't want to raise the salary so most people are going to be realizing hey that is that is not true it's the same thing i get every year and you're going to be realizing that it's because they don't want to raise your salary um that is the reason why um they are um you know doing these performance review and is you know it's the same thing every year your salary hasn't been raised for the last couple of years and for who the salary was raised for it is not um you know it's economically it's not helping you so i really see that some of you ladies are going to be thinking you know i have this i have that i can start something for myself and i see um you know you're going to be speaking to a loyal um um person someone who is very loyal to you and ask them you know what do you think um what is you know give me your idea about this and i see you you know whoever this person is is a loyal person whether it's in the company or it's in another company i see that they're going to be you know telling you the truth hey you're better than this um why don't you try to apply here they pay much better at that sort of a thing so I see a lot of you ladies are going to be, um, you know, getting together and realizing that 
some job situation that you're in is you know it's not for you anymore and you're realizing that um with these performance review um you know does it does it really worth it because you're giving so much and they're doing as if you know yeah um and you're there 24 7 and you're like okay um i see what is going on so we get average performance review because they don't want to increase our salaries. And I see that that is what is going to be transpiring. And some of you ladies are going to be making some decision in this week um, to move forward and um, choose for something else or look for something else. And I see lo a loyal person is going to be coming in and saying, hey, um, you know, I'm, I know a couple of people and I'm going to be asking if, there's an open and it's going to be good whatever is transpiring it's going to be very good because you're going to be alive and ready and things are going to be working out in your favor no matter what is going on i see things are going to be working out in your favor um remember whoever is borrowing from a loan shark i see you need a financial help you're going to be in some serious problem later because this person is going to be taking you for everything that you have so um be aware of who you borrow um, um, from in this week and whoever this loan shark is, your business people, this person is just a loan shark. Be aware. I got to say namaste. Check out the bi-monthlies because you're going to be finding out who these people are. And I'm out. Namaste. Namaste.